Fanny gets it. Not and, you, and you still get to have sex with these brilliant men. Yes, I do. Life is good. Life is very good. I do get to have sex with them. Um, and if they prefer the young girls to me, they're, man, they're, they're gentlemen enough not to show it. I don't know. I think they're very sincere when they say that they don't. So I think um, they are. I think they are too. You know, I, I wouldn't. I wouldn't be 20 again if you paid me. You know, if I could know then what I know now, of course I'd be younger. But when I look at how unhappy I was at 20 and how unsure of myself and unskilled and, and experienced, I wouldn't go back to 20. Plus, I look better now than I was. At, I did at 20. It's funny, actually. Oh God, 20. <laughs> So now, is it weird at all doing, uh, I mean, sex with two men uh, and your husband is directing you? Your sweetie is directing you? Well, he is my husband and my sweetie. Um, if, for me, it's not, for us, it's not weird. It's very much of a turn on because he's a director and I'm a performer. We're slingers. I'm very exhibitionistic. He's very voyeuristic and so it really works because we have, and we, do, we just know that However, my, my, my little motto these days is the more men I fuck, the more I love my husband. Um, because the more experiences I have with other men, the more I know that I married the right person. And one of the reasons I married the right person is he loves to watch me make movies. There's no jealousy issues, there's no possessiveness issues, there's no weirdness about what it is I do for a living. And it's very hard in this business for a, perform, a performing person to find someone who loves them for what makes them a performing person. And so Ernest loves me for this part of me that likes doing this, not in spite of it or as long as they didn't do it anymore, or as long as they don't talk about it too much. But he loves the part of me that loves to do this. And I love him because he is, a, like myself, a dedicated career pornographer. And this is my path in life. I'm happy with it, and I need a partner who supports it. And that's also his path in life. So we're very lucky, unlike other screen couples, that jealousy is never, never an issue with us. And I'm really grateful for that. I see it destroy a lot of other relationships in the business. So I love. He's my favorite director. I love performing for him. He's my favorite audience. Um, so I love having him in the audience. Yes. Do you wish that you? Do you regret that you didn't find him when you were? 22, so you can spend even more years with him. You know what I regret? I regret, I mean, I, I, this is a, a semi-secret. Um, I did have a three-way marriage for many years, and on the surface, I sold it really well, and people believed that I was as happy as I said I was, and I wasn't as happy privately as I made out that I was. And so, to be honest, I had an affair with Ernest um, in, in the early 90s, and I ended up, you know, breaking it off, going back to my husband to save my marriage. And so, yeah, sometimes we do regret that we missed eight years. I, I could have, we could have been together eight years longer than we were together. But it didn't happen, so we don't beat ourselves up too much for it. And during the eight years we were apart, we both grew a lot and learned a lot that would have been more difficult to do alone, to, uh, together. However, what we did miss out by, by my being too scared to break off my marriage, even when I feared that it was over. We missed out on our most productive years as actress and director. Um, you know, my 30s and his um, late 30s and early 40s, where just you get a lot of work. And so, often I often thought, because he was, he was in Berkeley when I was 18, and he was in town, so it's like, oh man. You know, if, it, if I met him then, that would have been so cool, because the person I did meet ended up being the wrong husband for 20 years. <laughs> but in the long run, we're very grateful. It's one thing about being middle-aged and having second marriages, how, how grateful you are for having found someone at all. And so if I get 20 years with him, or 25 years with him instead of 35 years, I'll just have to be happy with that. If I don't get 25 years with him, I'm killing him. <laughs> so you're in here first.